I2C communication protocol uses two wires to share information. One is used for the clock signal, SCL, and the other is used to send and receive data, SDA. The ESP32 supports I2C communication through its two I2C bus interfaces that can serve as I2C master or slave, depending on the user's configuration. Accordingly to the ESP32 datasheet, the I2C interfaces of the ESP32 supports 1. Standard mode, 100 qubit slash S. 2. Fast mode, 400 qubit slash S. 3. Up to 5 MHz, yet constrained by SDA pull-up strength. 4. 7-bit slash 10-bit addressing mode. 5. Dual addressing mode. Users can program command registers to control iSuperscript 2C interfaces so that they have more flexibility. We'll take a look at the I2C communication protocol with the ESP32 using Arduino IDE2. This very simple sketch scans the I2C bus for devices. If a device is found, it is reported to the Arduino serial monitor. In Arduino ID, click on File dash Preferences dash Additional Boards Manager URLs. Fill in https colon slash slash dl dot dot com slash dl slash package underscore esp32 underscore index dot json. In Arduino ID, select left side Boards Manager icon in the search bar. Type ESP32, select ESP32 Espressive Systems from the list of available boards. Click on Install to install the latest version of ESP32. After installation is complete. In Arduino ID, Click on Tools Dashboard dash ESP32 dash ESP32 Dev Module. In the Partition Scheme option of the tool, select the default 4 megabytes with SPIFS item.